Na kumwamini Mungu. Lakini Mungu hakuchoshwa na binadamu. Ilibidi ye mwenyewe akae chini. Na kwa upendo huo wote ikambidi amtume mwanawake. Na tunaona katika New Testament John chapter 3 verse 16 For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. Aliupenda ulimwengu na akapatiana mwanawake. Na alivompa mwanawake kwetu ili tupate kujua na kufahamu ya kwamba upendo wake upo kati yetu. Amen. I want to tell you today that the love of God is upon you. Najua wengi wamekueleza ya kwamba hakuna upendo au kuna vitu fulani unafaa ufanye ili ukapokee huu upendo but god loves you with an everlasting love and there is nothing that you need to do kuna mtu kwa biblia pale kwa jina nicodemus usiku anamwendea yesu na anaenda kumuuliza nitafanya nini ili nikapokee ufalme wa mbinguni naona yesu akimjibu kwa biblia akimweleza unafaa kuokoke na upate ubatizo lakini kwa nini Yesu anamjibu maneno haya anamjibu kwa sababu ilibidi wakati huo amjibu hivyo kwa sababu Yesu hakuwa amekufa na Yesu hakuwa ameondoka it was because there was a certain protocol lazima hao watu wangefuata but we see the essence of the matter inaitwa the love of god wakati Yesu alikufa na akafufuka ilibidi sasa tuingie katika ile hali ya kuelewa na kujua upendo wa Mungu. Saa hizi hatuhitaji ubatizo kuingia mbinguni. Hatuhitaji wewe wewe kutoa sadaka uingie mbinguni. Hauhitaji kufanya lolote lile uingie mbinguni. But this love it is all about you believing. It is about you trusting in God. It is about you understanding and knowing this truth and coming to this truth that you can be set free. So today we are here and we are here to tell you Ya kwamba the love of God is in bounty and this love is calling out this love does not come and it has not come to condemn you but it has come to set you free and to make you free indeed Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana so my dear brothers and sisters today nataka kuambia ya kwamba hii upendo ipo usijalishwe na nini ama nini si upendo ya kununuliwa Hauhitaji kitambara ili ukapate huu upendo. Hauhitaji mafuta ili ukapate huu upendo. You only need to have faith and faith in God in Christ Jesus. So today is the day that the Lord has made and we are here to declare to you that this very very love that Nicodemus saw na akaenda pale kumuuliza Yesu ndio tunakuja kukutangazia, tunakuja kukuelezea wakati Nicodemus alipata ufunuo akaenda kumuuliza yeye mwenyewe akapata kuelewa so kwa hivyo leo tunataka uelewe na upate kuelewa hii kitu na ujue ya kwamba uzima wa milele upo lakini kupitia Yesu Kristo mwenyewe so hatuna budi ila kusema asanteni sana kwa kutusikiza may the lord do you good and may god bless you in jesus name mbarikiwe sana